and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. As you guys can see, season 11 is officially here. So let's go ahead and take a look at everything that is new. First of all, let's see what you can get. And uh, I'm gonna turn on my audio real quick, but I'm sure you guys can hear all this fun stuff right now. But there's gonna be a brand new map called the, I forgot what it's called, but it's like a new snowy map, which I'm excited to try out. We'll probably be playing it a little bit later. And we got some new deals, actually. I think a new deal came out today or might be coming out soon. Who knows, who knows? Take a look at the event. That's probably one of the most important part. Take a look at our brand new character skin. It's gonna be another Tangu skin. I feel like we've had a Tangu skin not that long ago for a free character skin, but it is pretty nice. It's the Tangu Icy Eye. Not a huge fan of his voice line, but very clean skin. Probably one of the better ones for the free ones. Take a look at the seasonal one. You can get the special op Fire Frost skin. <laughs> Ooh, not the best one, Cod. Be real. Not the best one. And feature skin. Um, celebration for New Year's. So collect tokens. And I'm guessing that's going to be used for getting a battery skin. Who knows? You can also get this AK117 Fire Frost skin. And comics is always going to be there. Beside that, nothing crazy. Doesn't look like there's a new draw out right now. For say. But there's going to be the battle pass. I have not seen any battle pass um leaks or anything like that so we'll take a look i'm gonna be giving you guys basically my first impression vagar mortar infiltrate icebreaker and destroy the dark covenants we also have i don't know i'm just gonna skip off skip all through all this we'll see what we can get probably get the premium battle pass probably get enough to unlock the new gun so let's go ahead and just take a look at everything that is available before we buy and uh, give me a second. How did I already unlock this? I don't think I bought anything there. Anyway, I hope I have enough CP for this. Let's take a look at the battle pass right quick. So first things first, first character you will unlock is Vagar Modir. I hope I said that right. That could be insanely wrong. Looks like a brand new character. Really good skin. I like the details, the claws on the hand. Very beautiful skin. Very wintry vibe. KN Frost Bike. It looks like an AK, so pretty cool, pretty cool. I actually like this a lot. Does look like very similar iron sights. Not sure if it's custom or not. And then uh, let's see what else you can get here. You get this banner. And then we'll take a look at all the new stuff coming out here. At 12, you got Atlas Crash. Okay, that's kind of neat. Not, not the best. You get an Echo skin. You know I love myself some Echo shotgun it's like a gingerbread looking kind of gun pretty solid I'm, i feel like i'm missing some stuff we'll kind of take a look at the free stuff that people get we get the ammunition box that's actually really nice destroy a box oh wait deploy an ammo box and throw bows for you on your teammate shoot it at your own risk so i'm guessing if you shoot this it can potentially explode so you can throw on the hard point and someone kind of pushes that you might be able to uh, get some kill uh whatever striker there we go with the PKM. I actually had early access gameplay do it by luck. So uh, we actually have that already. So I don't have to worry too much about getting that, but we most likely still unlock level 21. Take a look at the MSMC skin. Whoa, whoa, that's a nice skin. That's really nice, the MSMC though. So I don't have the diamond for that, but uh, if you do plan on getting the whole battle pass, which I mean, honestly, I'm not a huge fan of getting the whole battle pass right off the bat. And also, if you are gonna play the game, you might as well get the battle pass near the end, just because it becomes cheaper. Keegan Huntsman, eh, nothing crazy there. A lot of credits and a lot of CP coming in. What is this one here? Looks like a Man of War. Ooh, wow. That is a nice Man of War skin, actually. I really like that. It looks like a giant bison to me, but very nice Man of War skin. Iron size is the important part. If this has custom iron size, like it does look like it. So that's gonna be a good reason to buy the battle pass. The Man of War's iron size are typically pretty bad, and this one looks pretty good, almost like the Cardinal one. So low key might be a reason to, to buy this battle pass. We get our HVK here, and then we have a backpack. And then our final character is Soap Cliffhanger. The female character is probably the best one. The Soap is not bad at all. Character skins are okay. And then the, the PKM Boru. So yeah, this is exactly the one that they accidentally released in the rank crates yesterday. So ultimately, nothing too crazy. But it is what it is. And I believe if you do buy the entire battle pass or you buy the, um, what should we call it? Where is it? Where, I'm, I'm so blind. If you buy the... Where's the buy battle pass? There you go. The premium one, they will give you a free, I don't know what they give you. The, the sickle? 
So let's go ahead and buy the battle pass. We'll buy the first one and then uh, we'll see. I mean, it might be worth it just to get the mana warp. Should I buy the entire battle pass? I typically play enough to unlock the battle pass. So Vagger, more deer. We're gonna see a lot of players running this. The KN skin, I think the gun skins are probably some of the best gun skins I've seen in a while. So I'm pretty impressed with that. Very, very happy. And I know there's supposed to be like a Bobby, Hawk's Nest, and Ferg skins coming out soon. I'm excited to see those. I have not seen any of those spoilers. I'm trying to be spoiler free for those to get my first reaction of that. So that's gonna be cool. Again, it's the same thing, first reaction of this. We got our sickle, which is very similar to the ice pick axe we got, or the ice uh, karambit. Very nice, very nice sickle. I like it a lot. And then snowman run, a bunch of these other things. And then I, I think we might purchase some more levels just to get to level 21. Let's see how much that, that'll get. That cost me, all right, it cost me only 960, so that's good. I have enough to unlock this. We're probably gonna grind this gold on stream. I don't know if I'll do it today or tomorrow. Probably not tomorrow, we'll see. Snow party available. Striker, polar ice. And uh, yeah, I mean, I, I'm really excited for the mana war. Just the mana war with the custom iron sight is probably one of the best reasons to buy it. But beside that, really nothing else available. New crates, maybe. Going dark crates have returned. Really nothing else new. I don't see anything new. Credit shop, anything new. Credit shop update, they usually make a post about it, so nothing new. Beside that, pretty uh, small, uh, I know, update. You don't have really much things here. Oh, actually, there is oh, there is one thing I do want to check out. And if I go to um, matches, there's supposed to be the featured holiday raid, which holiday raid is back. I guess a new map is not out yet. I think it should be coming out. New ice map, which should be pretty interesting. But anyway, it's gonna be a shorter video. I know you guys probably wanted to see the whole battle pass. I'm not the type of guy to buy the entire battle pass. I wanted to give you guys my first reaction though. So uh, pretty, pretty good. Uh, the KN and the character skin. Let's just equip the character skin. I mean, at least we show you guys how the character skin looks. Newest first, Vogger. She looks great, honestly. I am I am very impressed with this. This battle pass is probably one of my favorite ones when it comes to characters, uh, not characters, skin, gun skins. But character skin, there's at least one or two nice ones. Like that Man of War skin. Loki, where are you outside? They have the blueprint here. Now we can kind of check a look. Check a look. Check a look. Uh, take a look and see kind of how it looks. I guess I can't really see it though. All right. It looks nice though. The ma This Man of War skin. That's that I don't have yet. It, it, the iron sights, that's probably the best part, right? The iron sights are probably the best part of this. So, and the Manowar is pretty decent of a gun, so not bad, not bad at all. Let's go ahead and just uh, equip the KN skin that came with it. A little combo breaker here. I have so many freaking KN skins. Man! But oh, this is nice. This is nice. And if you add diamond on it, you guys can see it. it eh, it's okay. Not crazy. I think I'm over adding diamond on, on the skins, but look, look at his beauty. Look at his beautiful outfit. The gun is nice, doesn't really match, but overall not bad. Anyway, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!